Antimus. Out wide yet again. Here come the Union with Ua trying to play that for the Gazdag inside the area. Plays it back to Hario. Getting set to cross into the back post. Nobody home, but the ball stays in play here for the Union. Over to Real. Outside the area, we'll find Julian Carranza at the tip of the 18. Dashes inside with us. Right, tries to go right and goal and scores! Julian Carranza gets the scoring started for the Union at home. And it's 1 0. The boys in blue. It ends up being a really nice curling finish from Carranza, and that's gonna that's the highlight reel part of it. I love the bit before it. All the build-up, the tic-tac-toe passing to get to Harry on the right. Yes, he overhit his cross, but Real instantly spotted a teammate in a dangerous position, found him. Carranza did the rest. Yeah, thanks to the play. As you mentioned, the two guys who I thought had great first halves and Matt Real and Nathan Harriel as Carranza beat Duke, curled that into the back post with Jonathan stated one nothing Union. But there was an opportunity a little bit later on in the 30th minute by Lapalainen. And who else? Andre Blake had to stand tall yet again. Abdi playing this forward over to Ibrahim inside the penalty. Or back to Lapalainen. Now comes Andre Blake, who's a brick wall and steers it aside. Brick wall. Blake stands tall again, coming out from a six to deny Lapalainen. It was the most mobile flying brick wall I've ever seen because Andre Blake came out, stretched all akimbo to try and knock that one down and he did get a piece of it. maybe it was his chest and yeah. underarm I don't know but uh, the Union are very grateful that he did because the game completely changes if that goes in also made another stop later on but the 36th minute another goal for the Philadelphia Union it came from Carranza who tried to cross one in with his toe off the tip of his boot went off of Thorkelson and Pantemis and then it was Michael Lua right place right time for the club's second tally tonight. So poking forward, Carranza will find Matt Real in front of the 18, try to cross it, it went off of Saliba, right to Nate Harry, who dummy that forward over to Carranza, inside the area, turns it on Torkelson, almost a right goal, and the rebound good from Michael Lua! Went off of Pantelis, and Michael Lua snaps goalless in eight. Games across all competitions, there's number six for Ua, and it's two nothing Union. This all started from a bad Montreal giveaway. They are not playing their starters. They're resting them. Bad success over the last 13 plus years, the Red Bull Arena has been around. Uh, unfortunately, not the start that they wanted in terms of giving up the goal in the 18th minute, but uh, overall getting a little bit better as the game progresses. Second key is the great return. Big names came off injury list and onto the pitch in the last week. Uh, that included guys like Lewis Morgan. We'd expect him to step on the second half and be uh, involved in this lineup as well at some point. Defenders Frankie Amaya, Kyle Duncan, other players that have been injured for a while now getting some minutes. So we'll see if they um, factor into the second half. Third key is the streaks are they broken. For Orlando City, streaks are at stake heading into the next game against this New York team. The Lions are riding a four-game unbeaten streak. And that's a three-game streak over this Red Bull team. Um, hopefully, uh, we'll figure out a way to finish this, uh, this off a little bit better in the final third. You know, you look at our run of play, and it looks like there's a little bit of gaps between you know, our sixes and our front runners. But, uh, you know, as long as we can get guys in like Lakinas involved in the game, I think that's going to open up the game a little bit better for our final third. We'll keep you updated on potential changes from one half to the next. We throw into our halftime feature right now with Orlando City lead leading one nothing. Radio voice of the Lions, Evan Weston. Game one to game 17, the first half of the season comes to a close tonight for the New York Red Bulls. Uh, Evan Weston, the radio voice for Orlando City. Evan, these teams played all the way back in February. A lot has changed, obviously, uh, for both. Give me a little bit of a, of a first half season review for Orlando City, if you could. Yeah, it's been uh, it's been a little up and down. Um, there was a big off season uh, for Orlando. They made a lot of moves. Uh, I remember when we talked in February. Uh, you know, we we talked about how high the expectations were for Orlando City. I think it's safe to say that they haven't quite met those uh, at, at this point in the year. This is only game fifteen uh, for Orlando, so they have a little bit more time. But um, over the last few games, it looks like things have started to click a little bit. It seems like Oscar Pereja has found a. Uh, a mix of players that he likes. Uh, he's got his striker, Archankara, in really good form at the moment. Um, they've kind of made some adjustments in the middle of the field as well. 
Uh, and so they're starting to find that formula uh, that's going to work for them. I thought they played their best game of the year last week against Atlanta. They were dominant, uh, really played Atlanta off the park, just couldn't get that second goal. Uh, Brad Guzan made a couple of really great saves. They missed some chances. And then uh, Atlanta got a lucky one on a corner at the end. So it ended in a draw. But uh, they really should be two wins in a row for them. And, and honestly, three. I mean, they were they were better than NYCFC the game prior to that, too. So uh, they they are are getting closer. Uh, now, of course, a, a Red Bull away game is always going to be a little bit different than most games. So uh, you you understand that. But, uh, you know, and, and of course, Red Bulls are, are entirely different. Uh, coach, personnel, all that since uh, since uh, we saw them last. So um, probably not a whole lot you can take away from that first meeting. But it looks like it's starting to come together a little bit for Orlando. Whether that means they take that jump to MLS Cup contention, like we maybe talked about, or whether they're just solid playoff team, that's still to be determined. Yeah, walk me through, Evan, if you can. I'm I'm looking at results from the last four league games, draw against Columbus, draw with NYCFC. As you mentioned, good performance in a draw with Atlanta, and then a 3-1 win uh, over Miami a couple weeks ago. Red Bull just saw uh, enter Miami on, on Wednesday. What has maybe changed from the up and down yo-yo to the last four games, making sure they at least get a point? Yeah, they've made a couple of adjustments. Uh, Wilder Cartagena is a Peruvian midfielder, has come in uh, to form a partnership with Cesar Araujo, who is one of the most talented young uh, defensive midfielders in the league. And so that has enabled them to have a little bit more freedom for their fullbacks to get forward. In, in Oscar's system, typically the left back will stay back uh, and kind of be a back three with the ball. That is not really how Rafael Santos likes to play. So he had not been in the lineup because he just wasn't fitting what was being asked of, of the system. Now with Wilder in there, that's allowed Rafael Santos to get forward a lot more. He scored a great goal against Miami a few weeks ago. He's an excellent crosser of the ball. So that just gives them another option because right now they're, it's, it's a little bit like the Red Bulls, uh, although maybe not quite uh, to that level where they just need to score goals. Uh, they need to find ways to, to score goals and, and so that's happened. And then the other thing is that, you know, you mentioned, uh, I mentioned it earlier, Urchan Kara, a uh, guy who, who had a decent first year. He scored 12 goals. Um, but as a DP, you'd want that number to be maybe closer to 18, 20. Um, he has uh, come back from injury in the past few weeks and really hit his stride. Uh, lost a three-game streak with a goal last week against Atlanta. But even in that game, it was, was really great uh, hold-up play gave Atlanta a lot of problems at the back. Uh, so he's a guy that you're going to have to watch out for uh, that is in form and confident. And then his reserve, Duncan McGuire, uh, is a rookie out of Creighton who has four goals already this year and has been a real bright spot too. Uh, that's a sub that that has been made regularly over the past several games. So uh, th- there is a little bit uh, of, of personnel tweaks. Uh, Mauricio Pereira getting healthy certainly doesn't hurt. Um, and uh, we'll, we'll see if it can continue. But uh, right now it does seem like there's starting to be that, that those puzzle pieces are starting to come together a little bit. You know, I think, and Evan, we can finish with this one, a Red Bull team that I, you know, started with this marks the end of the first half of the season. And it's been such a, an up and down year stabilized as of late. They win this game today. I say they, meaning New York, they win this game today, the opportunity to move above the playoff line, um, which I think for this team would be a really big thing going into the international break for Orlando. You had mentioned a couple of games in hand. This is just their 15th. They had the schedule congestion at the beginning part of the season with Champions League and things like that. Has Orlando gotten maybe to the same point as New York where, okay, you're you're going from one half of the season to the next where you're really now starting to focus on where you are in the table in the East? Uh, maybe the very start of that. Uh, the thing is that Orlando really hasn't been below the playoff line all year. Uh, they really haven't been since Oscar Pereja took over the team. Uh, it's It's funny. Um, they have slumped late in seasons and had to win on the last day to get in each of the last two years. Um, but it was never really in doubt until then that they would make it. It's, it's funny that they just, I don't think making the playoffs is enough for this team. Uh, the, the expectations are higher than that. Uh, right now they're ninth, but again, they're, they have two games in hand. They're, they're higher than that in points per game. I think they're, they're sixth or so in points per game. They're also the best road team in MLS. Uh, they have three wins, two draws, and just one loss on the road. Uh, playing on the road tends to suit them. Uh, they're at their best in transition. And uh, so we'll see. I know Red Bulls has tried to keep the ball a little bit more uh, since since uh, moving on from Struber. So uh, we'll, we'll see if if uh, if that kind of plays into Orlando's hands. But 
Yeah, I think, you know, this is a big month coming up. They've got this game. They've got a very winnable home game next week against Colorado uh, that they really need to win. Uh, And then you look forward, they've got New England coming up after that on the road, which is a tough game, tough place to play. So I I think, yeah, that they, they want to be in that top four. This improvement is going to have to keep tracking linear, you know, up uh, for them to get where they are. They still have not gotten to a place with their new DP, Martino Heda, where he's starting consistently and, and feeling good. His counting stats are good, but he's, the performances are not quite consistent enough. So there's definitely room for improvement there with, with Orlando. We'll see what they do in the summer. But, uh, yeah, you're, it's a big month of June coming up, absolutely. Evan, appreciate you hopping on. It's always fun when these teams get together because the styles are so uh, very different. Um, we'll see how tonight plays out. Appreciate your time as always and look forward to catching up, my friend. Absolutely, Matt. Wendy's homestyle French toast sticks are so delicious, some are saying that they're better than their mom's breakfast. Excuse me, did you just say Wendy's French toast sticks are better than my breakfast? Mom, is that you? Answer the question. I said some people are saying that because they're so crispy on the outside and fluffy on the inside and perfect in every way. Uh Uh-huh. And what do you think? I think it's time to tell people to choose wisely. Choose Wendy's sweet and crispy homestyle French toast sticks. That's still not an answer. I participate in U.S. Wendy's during breakfast hours. Red Bull fans, we partnered with Affinity Federal Credit Union to bring you the first ever New York Red Bulls credit card. The RBNY card let you earn points to redeem for team merchandise exclusive experiences, and more. Earn triple points when using it at Red Bull Arena on Red Members and all sporting good purchases. Make sure you sign up today. Your club, more reward. The Honda Civic and the Accord are uniquely stylish in their own way. But do you know what they have in common? Reliability and comfort? Sure. Available turbocharged engines? Of course. But also, the driver having fun for no reason, except for the thrill of driving a Honda. Named 2023 Best Overall Brand, by Kelly Blue Books, KBB.com. Based on 2023 brand image awards from Kelly Blue Book, visit KBB.com for more information. NJIT has been making student success stories since 1881 and has the rankings to show for it. Nationally, Forbes.com ranks NJIT number one for student upward economic mobility. U.S. News and World Report recognizes NJIT as one of America's top 50 public universities. And on the international front, Newsweek and Make Magazine call NJIT one of the top maker schools in the world. What will you make at NJIT? Learn more at njit.edu. Provident Bank believes commitment isn't something you say, it's something you do. That's why they back it up day in and day out. In checking accounts with better rewards, with lenders that understand your business needs, and by supporting teams with the most committed fans. That's why Provident Bank is proud to be the official banking partner of the New York Red Bulls and unofficially the most committed bank in the world. Learn more at Provident.Bank. Congrats on the new house, honey. What's this? Carbon monoxide detectors? Yeah, put one on every level. Because you can't see or smell carbon monoxide. And when fuel-burning appliances aren't working right, CO can build up and be deadly. Guys, I'm on it. We just want to know you're safe. At PSENG, we're committed to your family's safety. Know how to prevent carbon monoxide poisoning. If your CO detector goes off, leave immediately. Then call 911. Protect the ones you love. Learn more at PSEG.com slash gas safety. Scoreboard time in Major League Soccer as Orlando leads New York on the back of an Ivan Angulo first half goal, one to nothing. Finals from earlier today, NYCFC New England in a scoreless draw.
The new Chevy Silverado HD puts you in command. Own strength with its enhanced available Duramax 6.6 liter turbo diesel V8. Own the lake with its available advanced towing technology. And own technology with an available 13.4 inch diagonal touchscreen. The new Chevy Silverado HD. Own work, own play, own life. Learn more at Chevy.com. Find new roads. Chevrolet. Other Dallas homegrown, not available for the home side here. And that's a big loss because Rio has been playing excellently, really holding down a lot of the foundation of that. Typically, when they play a dual pivot situation, it's either it's him and Quignon normally, and a lot flows through them. So he's definitely a big loss. And Norris is, is doing what he can to fill that void. It looks like a lot of the flow of the game, if you will, he may be a step or two behind. And that comes with experience and learning. Kyle Morella, Marty Dickerson here on our camera platform. Jonathan Yardley and Mike Vito back at the studio. I'm Dave Leno. Thanks so much for listening tonight as the Union once more take it 3 0 over CF Montreal. They are one of the hottest teams in MLS, unbeaten in 9 7 0 and 2. Four consecutive clean sheets here in Chester and four straight wins. On behalf of our entire crew, this is Dave Leno saying good evening from Subaru Park and thanks so much for listening for Philadelphia Union Soccer on 97.5 The Fanatic. You're listening to the Union Radio Network. Here's what a morning with Thomas' swirl bread sounds like. Mom. And here's one without it. Mom. They sound the same, but we all ate something we loved in the first one. It's our preferred loud morning, Thomas's. Wake up to what's possible. Whether you want to buy a new home, grow your business, or build your nest egg, So Facundo Torres in the 51st from the spot and then in the 72nd icing the game. That goal was assisted by Ivan Angulo and Martin Ojeda. Ojeda still getting involved in the goal contributions for Orlando City. Yeah, he always finds himself there. Uh, Love the secondary assist. He's got you would not say that he has has been like a slam dunk, you know, newcomer of the year contender or anything like that. He's mostly coming off the bench at this point in the year. And he's got three goals and five assists in 15 matches, nine starts. I mean, once he really gets going and it's obvious that the quality is there. I mean, look out. And with the win tonight, fans receive 50 percent off large regular menu price pizzas using code Lions wins because pizza is the official pizza of Orlando City Soccer Club. That valid is only available online at Pizza Hut dot Calm. Let's go now to the moment of the match brought to you by Exploria Resorts. Arujo holding off Tolkien. we come up into the middle of the field to press. Now it's Cartagena, and that's a great ball. Angulo's in. It's Angulo 1v1 with Coronel. Angulo shoots, scores! Ivan Angulo 1v1 with the goalkeeper, makes no mistake. Sticks it in with his left, and the Lions have an early lead in New Jersey. Well, it was down the right-hand side. Angulo now playing on the right-hand side. He was played in by Kyle Smith. He was one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper. He took his time. The defender came across. He cut inside him put it past Coronel. Outstanding finish from Angulo. Really composed. Gives Orlando the lead. That was the moment of the match brought to you by Exploria Resorts. It was Ivan Angulo getting choked up over here over that night. <laughs> well, Ivan Angulo getting it started early for Orlando City. We'll take a timeout here. When we come back, we'll crown a 
Heineken star of the match. You listen to the Heineken post game show on FM 96.9 The Game. Orlando City fans, as we gear up for another season, let's show how our game day passion is second to none. And whether you're heading to the stadium or planning to tailgate from the couch, Publix is your go-to destination for game day food. From snacks and dips to ready-to-cook meats to premium cuts of steak. And if you really want to take your tailgate to the next level, there's only one place you'll find those famous subs. Visit Publix.com slash Orlando City for all the tailgating recipes you need. Publix, where shopping is a pleasure. Whether traveling for business or pleasure, Orlando International Airport offers more choices in domestic and international destinations, conveniences, and amenities. And these choices don't stop there. MCO features over 30 airlines, expedited security screening options, and a Hyatt Regency hotel. With local and national brands for both dining and shopping as far as the eye can see, download the free Orlando MCO app to make the most of your next visit to Orlando International Airport. MCO, your Florida airport of choice. When you enter a place of business, you're owed a legal duty that the place of business is safe for you to shop in because they are making a profit from you. That's the law. Yet many times a normal day ends with injuries because that business breached that duty because they knew or should have known of the dangerous condition that caused your injury. It happens every day in many ways. Slip and falls where cleaning and maintenance were ignored, falling boxes and items stacked too high, and so many other unexpected occurrences and dangers only known to that business owner. I'm John Morgan of Morgan & Morgan. If you suffered an injury at a place of business, let our team investigate and report back to you. The duty to protect customers from harm is the law, and our duty is to protect you after that harm. Visit ForThePeople.com for more information, or on your cell phone, dial pound law. That's all. Morgan & Morgan, America's largest injury law firm. ForThePeople.com. In America, the future belongs to everyone. That's why we make trucks like Ford F-Series, America's best-selling trucks for 46 years straight and counting. Made for performance and capability. Made to play hard and work smart on and off road. That's because they're built Ford tough. So be future ready with Ford F Series, based on 1977 to 2022 calendar year total sales. Are you in the mood for something tasty? Come to Fortuna Bakery Cafe to try our famous empanadas. Delicious sweet corn cakes with cheese. Incredible guava cheese bread. And without a doubt, the best coffee in town. Visit any of our 12 locations and experience why Fortuna Bakery is the best in Central Florida. We have everything you need for a perfect birthday celebration. Fortuna Bakery Cafe. Mmm, so good. Proud partner of Orlando City. Orlando Health Jewett Orthopedic Institute is the official medical provider for more than 30 sports teams with the top orthopedic specialists right on the sidelines. But you don't have to be a professional athlete to be treated like one. The world-class team at Orlando Health Jewett Orthopedic Institute is here for you. We have more than 40 expert physicians trained to care for every part of the body. And coming this August, we're opening Florida's first dedicated orthopedic hospital. Learn more at orlandohealth.com slash ortho. Orlando Health. Choose well. For the latest Lions news and tickets to upcoming games, log on to OrlandoCitySC.com. Now, back stadium side, here's Scott Harris. Scott Harris, Heineken post game show, Orlando City with a 3 0 victory over the New York Red Bulls here with Evan Weston and Paul Shaw. And I know it went down to a match where Red Bull went down to 10 men and then eventually nine men in the final few moments. But Paul, for Orlando City, confidence boosting win on the road oh yeah couldn't couldn't wish for a more perfect night you know scoring three goals away from home clean sheet um Facundo Torres scoring a couple which is which is great for him um just a really good all-round all-round performance of course the red card just after half time for for Reyes changed the course of the game there's no doubt about that and that you know Orlando got a penalty straight straight after that but um, overall, a, a really good performance against the Red Bulls team that in the last couple of weeks have started to put some performances together. So, um, you know, I, th- I think the staff and, and the players are, uh, are going to really enjoy the evening, which they should do. But they're in a good run of form at, at the moment. They really are and playing well. We, we know away from home that their record is is, is unbelievable. But um, they're, they're now starting to...
scoreless in the 13th minute. When we come back, take a look at the highlights from the first half and bring you second half kickoff as Nashville and Dallas tied up at one in Frisco. This is Nashville Soccer Club on 104.5 The Zone. 3HL. Sports Illustrated swimsuit issue is out. Martha Stewart. In a swimsuit? Slay. No, She's saying. 81 years old. 81 years old. I'm going to pull this up. I'm going to be real. Slay, look at Slay. Look at Martha. I'm just saying, man, me and Martha have a good time. I mean, she looks, yeah, saying. she looks beautiful. Slay we have a is in love with Martha. Like, that was not right there. Sports I'm saying, like, I'm, cool, I'm cool with Martha right there. I'm going to be real. I'll run up on Martha. But I, well, I'm telling you, I'll catch Martha at the bar. <laughs> Monday, starting at 3 on 104.5 The Zone. As of March 2022. who you know you've got all this high priced attacking talent on this team and and for me and i i know you probably agree paulie angulo is undroppable yeah he really is and he's shown throughout the season you know you know he's played it right back he's play, played it right, right wing left wing he, he's played all over the place but not just his quality on the ball tonight you know he, uh, as you mentioned he scored a goal he created a goal for Facundo Torres but his overall all-round game his defensive game is 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 outstanding he's just a, the perfect wide player at the moment Drink and drive all the time. If you put away some drinks, put away your keys. Fans don't let fans drive drunk. Brought to you by the Tennessee Highway Safety Office. The inaugural League's Cup will see the boys in gold host Colorado Rapids and Toluca Liga MX at Geodis Park. Ticket packages are on sale now to lock in the best prices for the entire tournament. Buy tickets at NashvilleSC.com slash League's Cup. Download the Nashville SC app, your central location for all things Nashville SC. Get real-time stats, manage tickets, follow Nashville SC on social media, and much more. Go to NashvilleSC.com for more information. Hey, Jay, can you finish that induction range installation tomorrow? Orders have really amped up at Nate's Electric. We need to finish installing it first in May. Did we hear back from the grocery chain? It's no shock he needs electricians like yesterday. Smart fridge. Everybody wants one of those these days. Indeed can help him hire great people fast. I need Indeed. Indeed you do. We instantly connect you with quality candidates whose resumes on Indeed match your job description. Visit Indeed.com slash credit and get $75 towards your first sponsored job. Terms and conditions apply. The Dell Technology Summer Sale Event starts now with limited quantity deals on select performance PCs with Windows 11 Pro. Save on select Vostro laptops with built-in security features and select Latitude laptops with enhanced privacy, collaboration, and connectivity. Save on essential accessories plus free shipping and special financing with Dell Business Credit. Dell Technologies recommends Windows 11 Pro for business. Call a Dell Technologies advisor at 877-ASK-DELL. That's 877-ASK-DELL. Offered to business customers by WebBank, who determines qualifications for and terms of credit. We were ready to sell, but honestly, I got so overwhelmed with everything that needed to be done. The ripped screen door, the worn carpet, it's just too much. Accepting the guaranteed offer from Mark Spain Real Estate shortened my to-do list. Hi, this is Mark Spain. With the guaranteed offer from Mark Spain Real Estate, you can sell your home stress-free and receive the strongest cash offer in the industry. We filled out a quick form on their website and someone called us within minutes. And within days, we accepted the guaranteed offer and put in an offer on our new home. Thousands of homeowners are selling their home with our guaranteed offer to make maximum profit and skip the stress of selling their home. They have an average five-star rating with thousands of reviews. Trustworthy, knowledgeable about my area, and super responsive. All the things that were most important to us. With our guaranteed offer, there are no showings, no open houses, and no stress. They say they have the strongest cash offer in the industry, and that's true. And the value of getting all of my time back that I would have spent on home repairs, priceless. Sell your home fast or choose when you want to move. The guaranteed offer keeps you in control. Call 85 Five five two nine nine sold or go to markspain.com to receive a guaranteed offer on your home today and start packing. Certain restrictions apply. Back 
back at Toyota Stadium in Frisco, Texas, where National Soccer Club and FC Dallas are knotted up at one apiece. Lucas Panzika, Jalil Anibaba with you on 104.5 The Zone as we revisit the first half action. And it was lively to start. In the ninth minute, Nashville opened up the scoring with Shaq Moore whipping in across from the right wing, and it deflected off the head of the youngster, Nolan Norris, for a Dallas own goal. On the right wing, Moyle gives off to Moore, who cuts back to his left foot. Cross in, on the way, and in to the back post. Shaq Moore whipped in across, and it found its way into the back of the net. Off the head, as I said, of the 18-year-old Nolan Norris, and Nashville led early on, but it only took 15 minutes for the home side to equalize as Marco Farfan slid it across the box on the ground, finding O'Brien wide open at the far post. Ferreira threads it to the top of the box. Touched by Quignon. He plays Farfan down the left side of the box. Squared across and scored by Dallas. On the end of it was O'Brien. And all he had to do was poke it into the back of the net, sitting on the far post. And the home side has equalized here. FC Dallas makes it 1-1 in the 25th minute. Go all in with Renaissance Rewards' extra checking account and get the only yellow card you deserve. Get the very best in personal banking when you choose the checking account that comes with roadside assistance, cell phone insurance, more than 450,000 shopping discounts, and the Nashville SC branded MasterCard debit card. Must have a checking account to receive a debit card. Learn more at renaissancebank.com slash NSC member FDIC. Jaleel, when you look at the numbers from the first half, there's just not a whole lot separating these two, and that's really how it played out. Nashville slightly outpossessing Dallas. Boston, and it ended in disaster. He went to Brooklyn, and it ended in disaster. He went to Dallas, and I guess it's not. The 90 iHeart Sports DC. This is v the Sports Betting Network. This is Live Bet Saturday on v the Sports Betting Network. It's our final hour of Live Bet Saturday, presented by BetMGM, as we welcome you back to the South Point Sportsbook Studios in Las Vegas. I'm Ben Wilson. Danny Burke with us from Chicago, and things are getting hot and heavy here, Danny. Stanley Cup Final, Game 1, Golden... Coga Beach, FM 96.9 The Game. Orlando Health Jewett Orthopedic Institute. RBIs as the Guardians beat Minnesota 4-2. Tampa Bay Rays get the doubleheader split at Fenway with a 4-2 win over the Red Sox. Earlier, White Sox beat the Tigers 2-1 in 10. Game ending wild pitch from the Tigers' Jose Cisnero. Phillies beat Washington 4-2. Washington Post reports the career of Nationals pitcher Steven Strasburg could be over with severe nerve damage. Goff at the Memorial. Rory McIlroy, Siwoo Kim, and David Lipsky tied at six under after three rounds. French Open, Coco Goff, three-set third-round win over 16-year-old Mira Andrieva. Coming up Monday, as we approach the end of the NBA season, I'll tell you why I'm so excited for this year's offseason and all the potential moves we might see. Keyshawn, J. Will and Max, Monday morning at 6 Eastern on ESPN Radio, ESPN2, and ESPNU. This is Game Night, Game Night on ESPN Radio and on the ESPN app. 
It is game night here on ESPN Radio, presented by Progressive Insurance. He's the professor, Mike Wells. I am Matt Fontana. We got you for three hours, taking you up to 1 a.m. Eastern. We got a lot to get to when it comes to the NBA Finals. We'll dip our toe into a little bit of football throughout the evening as we go on as well. But looking back on game one of the NBA Finals and certainly preparing for tomorrow night and game two to see if the Heat can even things up. Uh, after a pretty dominant showing there from the Nuggets in game one uh, to take the 104 to 93 win uh, back there uh, a little bit earlier, Mike. And, and when I think about Denver in that game, it was more, in my opinion, watching it about Miami, right? Because there were so many questions about the time. Miami had, what, two days off coming off their seven game uh, series to take out Boston. Denver sitting at home for nine games. And I saw both sides of it, which I thought would have been interesting. Here's Miami. They might be a little tired, but maybe a little bit too much time off uh, for Denver. But the Nuggets came out at home, did what they needed to do, pretty dominant throughout the game. And I think really sent a pretty big message to Miami and really maybe the fans to the NBA that they are the better team in this. Not saying Miami's not going to win a game or two in this, but I was really impressed with what I saw out of Denver uh, in game one. Well, you know, Matt, contrary to what uh, what head coach Mike Malone said when he said, don't read the newspaper clippings, don't listen to the radio, please listen to us. Because I was curious after having, what, more than a week off after the Nuggets swept the Lakers? Loss, like it was the worst, worst moment since my wife left me or whatever. Like I, don't, I, I can't think of a good analogy, but like, This is kind of the breakup where it's like, okay, like, like we get it. You guys didn't like each other um, and you both seem happy without each other. So you don't need to keep talking about each other. Like it's ironic, right? Like this week there was a story that came out that Bill Belichick texted Tom Brady after the Super Bowl win in Tampa. Congratulations, blah, 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 blah. But I bring it up because that was one where Brady and Belichick, it just felt like Both sides moved on. Mm -hmm. Brady was happy, you know, new guy, new team, new coaching staff, new weapons. And Belichick kept doing his Belichick thing, and it just was what it was.
We're recording this progressive commercial on a real boat to let people know that when you bundle your home, boat, and other vehicles... What was that, Flo? Progressive saves you money, Jamie. Why are we doing this on a boat? We were going for authenticity. We're going to the city? Authenticity. You mean Atlantic City? But we're not in the Atlantic. Are we? Bundle your home and other vehicles with Progressive. Progressive Casualty Insurance Company affiliates and other insurers. Discount not available in all states or situations. Prize themed jersey patch giveaway presented by Ally. Don't miss the excitement. Visit charlottefootballclub.com slash tickets. We'll see you there. Smith Turf and Irrigation is proud to be an official partner of Charlotte FC. Smith Turf and Irrigation partners with all types of landscape professionals across the Carolinas to provide product and technical assistance for equipment, irrigation, drainage, outdoor lighting, and landscape supplies. Let us help you on your next project. Visit us at www.smithturf.com or one of our locations to find out more. Hey everyone, it's Brett Bronico, midfielder for Charlotte FC. For me, life is like soccer. You gotta have goals. Graduating from our hometown university, UNC Charlotte, helped me achieve my goals. What about your goals? Now, UNC Charlotte is offering a new online MBA, a premier program designed with the flexibility and affordability that will help you achieve your goals. Check it out at onlinemba.charlotte.edu. When you provide a five-star car buying experience, you get a lot of five-star reviews. Thanks to you, Hendrick has now received over 500,000 five-star online reviews. And we're the number one rated dealer group in the country in online reputation. It's Every parent wants the best for their child, especially when a cancer or blood disorder diagnosis is involved. The Center for Cancer and Blood Disorders at Children's Health provides incredible care. Our world-class pediatric treatment center is recognized nationally for exceptional clinical care and leadership in children's cancer research. When extraordinary care is a must, choose us. Children's Health. Incredible together. Cash, or you don't even have to come into a store. Just apply and get funded online for free at don'tbebroke.com. No checking account or collateral is ever needed at the DLC. We even give you over a year to pay it back, or you can pay it off early and stay big. Apply at don'tbebroke.com. Give us a call or find a dollar loan center near you. And remember, at DLC, your first loan is free in 2023. STN Sports is the only sports betting app you need. Hi, I'm David Wise, three-time Olympic medalist and proud Nevadan. I'm a registered donor. Did you know that more than 100,000 people in America are waiting on a life-saving transplant? I support Nevada Donor Network's efforts to raise awareness on organ, eye, and tissue donation. One heroic donor can save and heal up to 75 lives. Everyone has the power to be someone's hero. Join us at wearenevadans.org. Imagine if your everyday shopping allowed. Josviak approaches, shoots, he scores! The lit and the grit, the determination, the fight, the energy. In honor of your service and support for our country, Academy Sports and Outdoors is offering military and first responders 10% off your purchases. That was game changing. Both in store and online from May 1st through July 4th. Exclusions apply. Visit academy.com slash discount for details. To the team with the 
loudest allies never stop singing. Charlotte FC's 2023 season, here we come, because we're all better off with an ally. Visit ally.com to learn more. Hendrick, when you provide a five-star car buying experience, you get a lot of five-star reviews. Thanks to you, Hendrick has now received over 500,000 five-star online reviews. And we're the number one rated dealer group in the country in online reputation. It's all about caring for customers and providing an enjoyable experience. Come in and see what everybody's talking about. This is Hendrick. Don't miss a second of the action and join the biggest party in the Carolinas. Square ball right side for Cambridge. It's shot to the shot! It's not too late to lock in Charlotte FC season tickets for the remainder of the 2023 season. Plus, seat licenses start at less than $10 a month. Be part of every home match and every epic celebration. It's Cambridge again. It's Epic Scores! And a place for Brandon! Go to charlottefootballclub.com slash tickets to learn more today. Charlotte FC fans, there's nothing like celebrating game day with good friends and a great tequila. That's why Cuervo Tradicional, the 100% agave tequila that has been cultivating friendships for generations, is excited to be the proud partner of Charlotte FC. Cuervo Tradicional turns strangers into friends and friends into family. So here's to toasting a winning season with good friends and the original 100% agave tequila, Cuervo Tradicional. What's a Cuervo Tequila? 40% alcohol by volume. Proximo, Jersey City, New Jersey. Please drink responsibly. Hey everyone, it's Brad Bronico, midfielder for Charlotte FC. For me, life is like soccer. You gotta. Two, and that's where we stand after two periods of play. Out of town scores are presented by Betfred. Visit Betfred at betfredsports.com. No other games in the National Hockey League. As the Golden Knights and the Florida Panthers are battling in the Stanley Cup final. Game two will be Monday at 5 o'clock here inside T-Mobile Arena. The Golden Knights Express is operating now to get you to and from the Fortress. Fees are only $4 round trip with stops all over the Valley. For more information, visit rtcsnv.com today. We're back with more on the Intermission Report, presented by Dollar Loan Center. It's the Stanley Cup Final on the Vegas Golden Knights Radio Network. You know, a lot of lawyers who advertise here don't. To Lower.com Field in Columbus and Charlotte FC Falls 4-2 to Columbus Crew. Up logic, Jessica Charman here with you as we break down a game for Charlotte FC that was the final match of a three-match road trip for At Smith's, you can find the highest quality products at a great price in every aisle every day with Kroger brand. So you can stock up on your household favorites that are tried, tested, and loved by you. Because when you get the products you love at great prices, it feels like winning. Shop now, in store, or online. Smith's, fresh for everyone. for the Knights. Oh, what a check. Three on two as they cross the blue line. Shot goal! Can't make it to the game? No worries. Our official downtown partners at the D Casino have you covered. Every Vegas Golden Knights game is broadcast at the world-famous Long Bar at the D. Their high-energy flair bartenders will entertain you and keep you hydrated as you watch the game on their monster big-screen TVs. Catch all the Vegas Golden Knights action at your home for hockey, the Long Bar at the D Casino. Go Knights, go! I'm Shay Theodore, a defenseman for the Vegas Golden Knights and a cancer survivor. Cancer can strike anyone at any moment. For me, finding it early was key. You can tilt the ice in your favor with the Game Changers at Comprehensive. Learn to self-screen, get checked. Early detection saves lives. It saved mine. Saved mine. Comprehensive Cancer Centers. Defend yourself. 
We're about to start the third period, but first, here's Ryan Wallace with the intermission wrap-up on the Vegas Golden Knights Radio Network. The Vegas Nighthawks' second season is underway at the Dollar Loan Center in Henderson. Don't miss your chance to bring the family out to a game and catch the excitement of the Indoor Football League. Visit NighthawksFootball.com for details. It's the intermission report, the Golden Knights and the Florida Panthers tied 2-2. and two. After two stats of the period, presented by the UPS Store, your locally owned print and business services center. Shots 14 apiece in that second period. Shot attempts 24 to 19. Florida scoring chances tied at nine apiece. And high danger chances 6 to 3, the edge to the Golden Knights. In all situations, according to Natural Statric, hits 26 to 23. Florida, Florida 0 for 2 on the power play. Vegas 1 for 3 on the power play. Florida with nine giveaways, four takeaways, six block shots. Vegas, 12 giveaways, 12 takeaways, 14 block shots. I liked a lot of the Golden Knights game in the second period. I, I really did. Outside, obviously, of kind of the breakdown that leads to that fantastic save from Aiden Hill, I think the Golden Knights kind of got back into their rhythm. They were able to get pucks in deep. They really did, for stretches, hem the Florida Panthers into the zone. And there were great opportunities, fantastic chances for the Golden Knights to extend their lead unfortunately they're just unable to find that next goal and you know I, I didn't like that shift that led to the offensive zone face off for the Florida Panthers the Golden Knights had the puck on their stick with options just kind of gave the puck away I, I don't know that Bruce Cassidy is going to like that in that stage of the period but then you've got to give a lot of credit to the Florida Panthers they want to face off Anthony Duclair who could not stick with Shea Theodore on the on the Theodore goal gets the equalizer for the Florida Panthers and just as I think we all kind of expected this is going to be a series this is going to be a game certainly where the Florida Panthers and the Golden Knights there's not much that differentiates these two teams they're very very good very very close and I cannot wait for the third period third period action is coming up next Dan and Gary they've got the call presented by Dollar Loan Center it's the Stanley Cup final on the Vegas Golden Knights radio network In the business, not giving an opinion on the business. And Paul, that's why we've all come to know you and your expertise. You're the professor who knows what's going on, but also that, that friend and that voice that we listen to on the radio that is sharing free advice. You doled out for 15 years here on WBT on your program. Thank you, Jim. And folks, if you want a coach, a friend, a guy who gets it done along with his team, it's Paul Jamison at Jamison Realty and Property Management. Call 704-846-DONE. That's 846-DONE. Take a look at the floors and furniture around your windows. Now, if you've seen discoloration, that's a sign your windows are just not protecting against the sun's UV rays. Hey, it's Boomer from my friends at Window Nation. And for a limited time, Window Nation is offering five years, 0% interest. Plus, they'll give you two windows free with every two you buy. You know what? These windows will save you money on your energy bills, and they will protect your home better. Many homes in Charlotte are 15 to 20 to 40 years old, and windows don't last forever. So the technology around windows has gotten so much better. You'll see that with Window Nation. Hey, if you act now, you call the experts at Window Nation and lock in limited time savings when you need them the most. 866-90-NATION. That's 866-90-NATION. Pay absolutely zero interest for five years, the life of your loan, and get two free windows with every two you buy. 866-90-NATION. That's 866-90-NATION, or go to windownation.com and tell them Boomer sent you. We are all getting older, which is probably better than the alternative, I guess. But as we age, our metabolism slows, and that could be the reason for weight gain. Pete Callender here, and maybe you're like me, and you've battled weight gain your entire life. Either way, take my advice here. Make an appointment with PhD Weight Loss and Nutrition, the official partner of the Clemson Tigers, and they just opened a new North Charlotte location. It's the first step. Make the appointment. The next, you'll meet with the awesome staff of nutritionists and coaches. You get a personalized, customized 
customized meal plan specifically designed for you and all the support you could ever hope for as you get healthy and thinner. It's a holistic approach with behavioral support because 80% of any life change comes from the mind. They help you tackle mental and emotional habits and behaviors, and you get maintenance support for free for life. It's like an addiction recovery process, and it works. I let go of more than 90 pounds. You can do it too. So if you are ready to start your weight loss journey, go to myphdweightloss.com and take your first step today. Welcome back to the Charlotte Football Club Radio Network. FC falls 4-2 to Columbus Crew. It was Christian Ramirez in the fifth minute on an assist from Cucho Hernandez, intercepting a pass at the beginning of the contest on distribution back from Bill Tuiloma. It was Max Arfson in the 21st minute getting his second goal on his second MLS shot on assist from Ramirez and Yao Yaboa. It was a 43rd minute goal from Cucho Hernandez on an amazing individual effort on the half volley from Zellerayan. Ramirez added another in the 59th minute after Charlotte FC pulled two back on Carol Svidersky on an awesome pass from Ashley Westwood inward to Svidersky. Justin Merrill with an intercept of a Columbus crew distribution out of the back to get the second goal, but then Christian Ramirez put it back on there. This game was defined by individual errors on both sides. It's just Columbus were better equal to them in this contest. Yeah, and I think that Columbus's were few and far in between with the one real defensive error in terms of the giveaway that Merrim was able to capitalize on versus Charlotte FCs that seem to be continually affecting them. The biggest issue, though, is the fact that they've got an individual error in the fourth minute with Tui Loma passing the ball square. And when you give yourself a 1-0 deficit that early on in the game, it's already making yourself very difficult. All the game plan you had, all the tactics go out the window when you can see it that early. Charlotte FC falls 4-2 in this one. 52nd minute, we go to our ally save for the match from Christian Kalina, one of the four he made, or sure, one of the three, excuse me, he made in this game. The number 10 for Columbus approaches, sends it toward the back post. A one touch by Hernandez and a save made by Christian Kalina. That was one where Kalina had to be rightly done on the position, down on his knees, and he's able to make the save. Kalina dives down to his right-hand side, covers well. Good technique to hold the ball clean. Again, is his reading of the game, understanding his position, and that drop step to set himself on his line. Whether it's banking, investing, home loans, or auto finance, nothing stops Ally from doing right by you. Ally, do it right. It's an unfortunate game for Kalina because while he didn't necessarily make what would be considered an individual error, there were some positioning issues in terms of the way he defended some of those goals, and unfortunately, uh, it wasn't necessarily one of the best nights at the office for number one. Yeah, anytime as a goalkeeper you concede four goals, you're going to be disappointed. Uh, I think he was set up for failure on most of the goals. Their giveaways, they're unmarked, they're not stepping, but at the end of the day, as a goalkeeper, if I'm in his position, you hold yourself accountable. It's one of those where your communication has to be better to try and hold your team accountable to not allow yourself to be thrown under the bus like that. It, it was a tough one. First time Charlotte FC concedes four this whole season. He had to see 18 shots, seven of them on target, which is the second most given up by Charlotte FC this season. Charlotte Falls 4-2 to Columbus. The highlight montage when we come back on the Charlotte FC radio network. It's bow time. <laughs> A Bojangles biscuit maker knows a thing or two about scratch-made buttermilk biscuits. Actually, it's 49. That's right, 49 savory steps. So yeah, we know biscuits like the back of our hand. Because, well, these buttermilk biscuits are... Made by hand. Yep, that southern know-how is our bread and butter. And if you're still wondering what makes a Bojangles biscuit so good, well, just ask your mouth. Mmm. Yep, that's what we thought. Get a scratch-made kitchen fillet biscuit from Bojangles today. Order ahead in our app, and it's bow time. <laughs> The wait is over, and the party is back. Charlotte FC returns home Saturday, June 10, to take on the Seattle Sounders. And the boys in blue need you to bring the energy. Are you ready to party, Charlotte? Celebrate Pride Night, featuring a soccer brawl celebration and Pride-themed jersey patch giveaway presented by Ally. Don't miss the excitement. Visit charlottefootballclub.com slash tickets. We'll see you there. 
Smith Turf and Irrigation is proud to be an official partner of Charlotte FC. Smith Turf and Irrigation partners with all types of landscape professionals across the Carolinas to provide product and technical assistance for equipment, irrigation, drainage, outdoor lighting, and landscape supplies. Let us help you on your next project. Visit us at www.smithturf.com or one of our locations to find out more. You can be the ultimate goalie when it comes to preventing underage drinking. The CDC calls underage drinking a public health crisis, but thankfully that's changing. Fewer teens are drinking with the help of initiatives like Talk It Out NC, who give families the assist with resources and facts to support conversations about preventing underage drinking. Prevention starts with a conversation, and together we are the solution. Visit TalkItOutNC.org to start the conversation and help prevent underage drinking today. The only way to be your best self is with your best health. When you have a health partner who doesn't just treat part of you, they care for all of you. That's why more people prefer Atrium Health, because unrivaled care is easier, more accessible, and more complete than ever before, so that you can enjoy more of the moments you love. That's what it means to live meaningfully, to live joyfully, to live fully with Atrium Health, official health care provider of Charlotte FC. Hey everyone, it's Brett Bronico, midfielder for Charlotte FC. For me, life is like soccer. You gotta have goals. Graduating from our hometown university, UNC Charlotte, helped me achieve my goals. What about your goals? Now, UNC Charlotte is offering a new online MBA, a premier program designed with the flexibility and affordability that will help you achieve your goals. Check it out at onlinemba.charlotte.edu. because we're all better off with an ally. Visit ally.com to learn more. Welcome back to the Charlotte Football Club Radio Network. Columbus Crew with a 4-2 victory over Charlotte Football Club. Their seventh win on the season for Columbus, seventh loss on the season for Charlotte FC. Charlotte FC will go to sleep and end the weekend in ninth place in the MLS table, which still is a playoff position. It would mean that they would be in that 8-9 play-in contest, but Charlotte FC was as high as sixth a couple of weeks ago after the victory over LA Galaxy, so they'll need to at least get themselves back to square a little bit if they want to be thick in the playoff competition going into the nitty-gritty part of the season as we've just crossed halfway during Charlotte FC season here on match day 17. Let's bring you now the highlight montage of this end-to-end -end contest between Charlotte FC and Columbus Crew. We are dealing with a little bit of weather right now in Columbus. This game does not look like it's going to start on time. Rain delays. Alex Chilowitz has his hand on the watch, points to the opening match, and we are underway. Plays it back to the back line for Tuiloma, and he'll cross it back towards Chomachinsky, and a giveaway. Back to the last third, a shot, and they score. And that's Kuch, or excuse me, here's Jim Ramirez on the right side on the giveaway, on the right side for Arston. Arston into the last third with it. Arston with a dribble with a shot, and he scores. And Max Arston with his first NLS goal in his first First MLS start. Kept alive by Ajiman on the last third, right side for Vargas. Kale was into the area towards Kale with shot, and they score! Chilowitz has the hand of the ear. He is checking right now between the foot of the defender and the body of Merriman. and I think at that glance he's going to say no goal. No goal offside given, and the goal is taken off the board. Merriman will try to get around his man. Arfstead does so, still in the area. To the top of the box, Oppel, a shot, save made, a rebound, and it couldn't go across the goal mouth 
Hampton home as it was Swiderski who got so close to pulling it back again. Zilla Rayad and the York trying to set a chip in and a one touch by Cucho and they score. And what a goal by Cucho Hernandez on the half volley sent from Zilla Rayan and Columbus three to the good in the opening half. The number 10 for Columbus approaches, sends it toward the back post. A one touch by Hernandez and a save made by Christian Kalina. That was one where Kalina had to be rightly done on the position down on his knees and he's able to make the save. Westwood sending Swiderski into the area. Swiderski makes one touch of the area and it goes through the legs of Schulte and they score. Carol Swiderski put it through the wickets of the Columbus goalkeeper. Nice cushion touch out of the air. Cheeky little finish to nutmeg the goalkeeper. The urgency on the restart and then a glorious delivery for the assist. We've seen three goal deficits during this season erased out by teams. As I keep away in the middle and a chip by Bear. They score! Just like that, Justin Merrim turned about his fair play as a defensive error from Columbus and all of a sudden Charlotte's within a goal. Momentum at its finest. Justin Merrim sniffing out the error and pouncing on the loose ball. It's Arfston into the last third right side. Arfston into the area for Christian Ramirez. The shot and they score. And that is the final whistle. Columbus 4, Charlotte FC 2. Charlotte drops back-to-back -back games for the first time since the opening trio of the season. Tough way to go down for Charlotte FC. They fall 4-2 to Columbus Crew. Final thought and the MLS scoreboard. And we'll look ahead to next week when we come back on the Charlotte FC Radio Network. This is Greg Trzynski of the Original Mattress Factory. Would you ever consider paying for your new mattress two times? It sounds expensive, but that's exactly what happens when you buy from a mainstream mattress store. The manufacturer marks it up, sells it to the retailer, who marks it up again and sells it to you. Because the Original Mattress Factory sells factory direct, the mattress you buy is being sold for the first and only time, providing real value. Don't buy your mattress twice. Visit the Original Mattress Factory today. At the Original Mattress Factory, we make mattress shopping easy. We offer our lowest and best price to everyone, every day, so you can shop when you're ready. We show you exactly what's inside of our mattresses, so you can see and feel the quality for yourself to ensure you're getting the best value. And we offer a no-pressure shopping experience. Our team is here to help you find the best mattress for you. It's that easy. Visit an OMF location today to see the Original Mattress Factory difference for yourself. Bo Thompson back here with Sean, and Sean, your family is a Monarch Dentistry of Gold Hill family. We've been there as a family about three years. My wife uh, needed some emergency help. She went over, got great care, and uh, immediately the whole family switched. You, you kind of understand how that happens. Well, yeah, I mean, that's not a decision you make lightly, and the whole family, that means Dr. Teresa Mercado and her team made quite the impression. A large impression. The way she talks to you, the treatment plan she puts together. You you actually get to be a part of putting it together too. If, if there's something that you don't quite want to do, she listens to it and adjusts to what, what you want to do with the atmosphere there. It almost makes you want to go to the dentist. If you care about your dental health and your overall health, I would get on the phone today and call Dr. Mercado's receptionist, Karen, and make an appointment. So here's the number, 803-547-7779 or online at monarchdentistryofgoldhill.com. You know, Bo, I am just thrilled to be a patient at Monarch Dentistry of Gold Hill. Spring is here and summer isn't far off. Nobody wants to see that old dad bod at the beach. Come into Low Country Mail today and get that weight off, get your energy up, and get your game back in the bedroom. Our concierge testosterone plans are $220 a month and include testosterone, doctor visits, and labs. We also offer semaglutide, the amazing medication that eliminates food cravings, lowers A1C, and burns fat. Most patients lose 35 pounds or 15% of their weight with no change in diet or exercise. Make men men again. LowCountryMail.com. Nothing beats a fairway green line. Here's Kevin from Fairway Green. Time to get busy, right? Yes, it's nice. We're starting to warm up, and time is running out to get that first application of pre-emergent crabgrass control down before that crabgrass starts to germinate. Both warm and cool season grasses need attention this time of the year. You want to make sure you're using the right products on your lawn this time of the year. Nothing beats a fairway green lawn. Put them to work on yours now. Go to fairwaygreen.com to request a free online estimate or call 704-392-0811. 
Go wild in a new Ford Explorer, courtesy of Catawba Two Kings Casino. Explore the outdoors May through July for the chance to win free play or one of three Ford Explorers. Earn double entries on Tuesdays, triple on Wednesdays, quadruple on Thursdays, and ten times on select days. Grand prizes drawn in July. Explore the outdoors only at Two Kings. See official rules and dates at the Lucky North Club. Regulated by the Catawba Nation Gaming Commission. Must be 21 to play. Gambling problem? Call the National Council on Problem Gambling. 1-800-522-4700. Columbus 4, Charlotte 2, final from Columbus. Look at the other scores throughout MLS. Light night in the MLS scoreboard. It's Minnesota and Toronto playing to a 1-1 draw. Lorenzo Insigne back on the score sheet for Toronto. Philadelphia blanking CF Montreal 3-0. It's Orlando 3 and New York Red Bulls 0. Facundo Torres with a brace for Orlando. D.C. United with a 2-1 victory over Miami. Uh, Christian Mateki with a 90th minute goal that ends up being the game winner because because Miami pulled one back in stoppage time. Cincinnati won Chicago nil. Lucho Acosta gets the goal for top of the table Cincinnati. Still in action right now at halftime. It is Colorado and San Jose tied at halftime. St. Louis a 3-0 lead on Houston. That game is almost over in stoppage time in St. Lou. Nashville 2, Dallas 1. Honey Mukhtar has gotten the deadlock breaker in the 82nd minute for Nashville. Salt Lake 1, Austin nil. Still to come later on tonight as well, Vancouver hosting Sporting Kansas City. A week from tonight, Charlotte FC is back home at Bank of America Stadium for their final game before the international break when they host a Seattle side that is much different, Jessica Charman, than the side we saw a year ago in Seattle. It is indeed, but Charlotte FC can't focus on the opponent. They have to focus on their own individual talent right now. They have to focus on being able to cut this slump because it's the poor run of form, and it's very easy for a slump to turn into a terrible downward spiral. They need to find a way to pick up the momentum and performance at home in front of their incredible fans. Christian Latanzo is saying after the game, Jess, that we're doing the best we can with what we have. Uh, it seems like another comment about the players that they do not have available to them, Carujo, Capetti, and Josviak, et cetera, but it's something where I think Charlotte FC is really have to they have to be able to control what they can control, so to speak. And it also shoots kind of your players that you do have in the foot a little bit saying that they're not good enough in some sort of way if you read it like that. For me though, every team has injuries. You talked in the pregame show about Columbus. One. Hey, hey, here's my prediction right now. Jimmy Butler will take at least six free throw attempts by the end of the first quarter tomorrow night. Wow. He is going to come out, and he is going to force the officials to blow the whistle. He is going to attack, 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 attack. He will get at least six free throws by the end of the first quarter. You're going to see a different Jimmy. He knows it. While they have a nice supporting cast, Jimmy knows he
Houston Methodist Hospital has always and will always invest in its people. As a leading healthcare organization, Houston Methodist recognizes that supporting its team is at the heart of providing unrivaled care. Houston Methodist Hospital is currently hiring for registered nurses and nurse leaders across specialties. Join Houston Methodist Hospital in the heart of innovation in the Texas Medical Center. To learn more and apply for a nurse job, text HMH to 45991. With summer savings at the Home Depot, we'll get your kitchen clicking. With top brand appliances, like a new GE refrigerator with internal water dispenser for a crisp, cool glass of water every time. Or a GE oven with built-in air fryer for healthier, crispier options with no preheating. Plus, with convenient shopping in-store and online at the Home Depot, your innovative new appliances... Wendy's $3 breakfast deal is a bacon or sausage egg croissant plus small seasoned potatoes for three bucks. It's the breakfast that don't miss. So if you did miss Wendy's breakfast, don't imagine fresh cracked eggs, sizzling sausage, crispy bacon, and block out those hot, buttery, flaky croissants. Croissants don't really make a sound, but if they did, for a breakfast that don't miss, Wendy's is that breakfast. Choose wisely. Choose Wendy's $3 breakfast deal. Limited time only. Participating U.S. Wendy's. Select a request $3 breakfast deal to obtain discount. Not valid for all the Carter combo orders. Good time starts with a great wardrobe. Next stop, J.C. Penney. Family get-togethers to fancy occasions, wedding season two. We do it all in style. Dresses, suiting, and plenty of color to play with. Get fixed up with brands like Liz Claiborne, Worthington, Stafford, and J. Farrar. Oh, and thereabouts for kids. Super cute and extra affordable. Check out the latest in-store, and we're never short on options at jcp.com. All dressed up, everywhere to go. J.C. Penney. I switched to Assuming this pause right here is potentially a red card offense, and they're going over to referees going over to the monitor right now, and this is going to be interesting. Can't imagine that that would be a red card that far out from goal, but and it is currently under review for denying a goal scoring, an obvious goal scoring opportunity. So that is what is currently under review. We'll find out the decision here shortly. But Robert Castellanos found himself in a similar situation on the road against the San Jose Earthquakes. This would be harsh. It, it would be very and, harsh. He's that and it's so it, exactly that I, field position matters immensely with this. And and while Cordova gets on the inside of Castellanos, Castellanos still had enough leverage in that situation to where he would have been able to recover. That, that's not a red card for me uh, at all. Now, Kendall McIntosh is also out of the box. Would they also consider the fact that maybe Cordova gets a touch and chips? I mean, that's just when we're talking about obvious goal scoring opportunities, I think you got to be just about on the doorstep in my opinion, yeah. or, or close at least to the 18. I, I hope that the ref does not make this decision right here. Andreu Fontas can slide across. He's back there. To me, this is a yellow card and get this play underway. And we've got a final decision after further review. No red card offense was identified. So the ori original decision will stand. Castellanos will just enter the books with a yellow. That said, like you mentioned, Jacob, still 
going to need to manage the rest of this game in a smart way. Still uh, a lot of time left as we are only in the 10th minute. It's a good decision from the referee, though. That would have, like you said, been very harsh. Either way, still a free kick here to deal with with Vancouver Whitecaps. Julian Gressel, Luis Martins, both really good servers of the ball, off of dead balls especially. We're going to have to be locked in for this one. Martins to take it. And that one right into the path of Kendall McIntosh. And Denbe cuts it back to Fantas, sporting patient in their build out. Fantas now looking long and unable to connect with anyone in sporting blue. Vite dispossessed by Eric Tommy in the center circle. He turns on the Jets, he's darting forward. Step over, but still under a lot of pressure. Goes backwards to Davis. Plays it back to Castellanos and Sporting Kansas City now going the other way. Tommy brings it down into Polito. Polito dribbling at. The Whitecaps back line goes backwards to Tommy, across to Rodoya, sends it over the other way to Ndenbe. change clothes and then and then slide over to the Taco Bell late night drive through to get myself my chalupa but um yeah man it's just the 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 vibes are are really really high right now for for Nashville and you know as we were listening to to coach Gary Smith just debrief the match one of the questions that came in to him was how do you celebrate this but still Leibold, under pressure by Cordova, leaves it for Shallowy. Now Voltaire, backwards, Rodoya, in between the two center backs for SKC, across to Castellanos. Rodoya takes a little bit of space, goes backwards again to Castellanos. Cordova bringing a little bit of pressure. Castellanos looking long for Janice. For Davis, John East now on the ball. Out wide to Davis. Tommy. Back to John East, looking across. That one headed away. And no one there able to win it back for sporting. Whitecaps. Out driving into sporting's half, going backwards. Again, as they're just trying to bring the ball under control, we're in the third minute of this stoppage time. Vite to Martins. Jacob, a lot of possession here for the Whitecaps. Is this is this how Sporting want to close out this game? Let them have the ball and just chase them around and keep them at bay a little bit? As long as it's near the half field line, but it's these passes that break lines. As Golden White combining in the box. Sporting trying to just play out of all this pressure. Cordova taking the ground by Rodoya. And this one, just a few yards 
from the top of the arc and will set Vancouver up for another dangerous free kick. And this one's a good spot. It's a great little combination. It, it's fine if Vancouver have possession by the halfway line. It's just cutting out those passing lanes right there. They were able to split the lane to find Brian White. It eventually led to this foul. Well, you have Gressel, Luis Martins. I would imagine this is going to be Julian Gressel. Kendall McIntosh getting players in front of him organized. Gressel into the wall again. Second time in this game. He was upset after that one, but Ryan Gold picks it back up on the right flank, trying to drive into the 18, able to play the cross, punched away by McIntosh, and eventually played out by Tommy. Some good reflexes there by the keeper for SKC. Vite 